I don't like being in prison. You don't like being in prison? No. I've hated it. Always hated it. You've always hated prison? The whole idea of a cell, just anathema. And welcome into the Rowdy Studios, where today's topic is Kurt Busch, Buzz Cutler, vowing before the Coca-Cola 600 to be kinder and gentler on the radio, and then finishing forth. Let's start by listening to the quote from Kurt Busch. This is his pre-race media availability. You know, I always laugh and and sit there and listen to you guys contradict yourselves on saying you want us to be more colorful, but all what you want to do to a driver is just thrash him when he shows personality. So that's, uh, that's what I'm going through with this radio. And from now on forward, there's not going to be anything on it except solid team communications because that's all that there needs to be. All right, so let's talk about performance for a second, first all right. of all. Because Kurt Busch has been struggling this year. And he said before the race, it's in the front end. We can't get the thing to turn. We have a tight condition. Now, he was not in a race-winning car in the 600, but he was in a better vehicle than he's been in at a lot of these downforce tracks. And I think it's not totally coincidence that he's vowed to be a little more constructive on the radio because at some point when you just bash your team over and over again, it's great that you want to win so badly. It's great that you have passion and that the team feels that. But when you bash the guys over and over again at some point, they just don't feel like working for you anymore, man. And you got these crew guys have to want you to win. Well, and you also have to convey useful information. And you got to be part of the solution. Yeah. Now, let's talk about the other aspect of that quote, which is Kurt's contention that the media just thrashes him. The media, I think, for the most part, we know a lot of the beat reporters, and I don't think the media, for the most part, has an agenda. It's not like, ooh, I get to thrash Their Kurt agenda Bush. is, let me get readers. Exactly. So, Kurt Bush, you actually thrash yourself by unleashing a torrent of profanity on the radio. The NASCAR media is not the same thing as a PR firm. The media's job is not to put a positive spin on everything and report the happy place stories. The media's <laughs> job is to report what you say and do, Kurt. And I'm sorry if you feel victimized. Maybe you should watch what you say, but don't blame the media for being a knucklehead. The reason these drivers make all this money isn't just because they're really good drivers. I'm awesome at tiddlywinks, but I don't make a lot of money You're because of that. not as good at tiddlywinks as you think I'm um, awesome. The okay. reason they make all this money is because people care that they're really and, good drivers. And, how and when people care, they want to know what's going on with you. That's called being a celebrity. That's why you have all that money and the nice house and the boats and all the rest of it. You can't have the one without the other, Buzz Cutler. So if you're going to be kind of jerky on the radio... Everyone's going to know about it, and that's what's going to happen. The, the radios are open. So everybody listens to the radio, and everybody knows that. So don't act shocked when people get bent out of shape because you're uh, jerky on the radio. And you weren't jerky, so now we like you. All right, that's been our conversation. Well, see, that's, that's just it. I don't dislike Kurt Busch. I don't have an agenda. Oh, you're agendaless? I'm agendaless. You really should well, put something on. I am male. <laughs> that's our look at Kurt Busch. <laughs> that's something different. Rowdy.com. Say it like it is. Say what like it is. Robbie.com.